All right, I'm back. It's your one and only second exodus here with another video. And today, real quick, I want to talk about we always don't need a tactical bag. We might want to look at a bag that's more civilian oriented. The reason why I bring this up is recently I went to Disneyland, not once, I went twice. Disneyland, California Adventure, Disneyland, California Adventure. I enjoyed them both, both times. And obviously I'm not going to go there with a tactical bag. No, I'm not. I'm not going to do that. You can do that, but I'm not going to do that. So I took my Cotopaxi bag, which I did a short little videos on it, and it worked great, but it's not made for outdoor events where you need water bottle pockets because they don't have it. It's made more for you want to pack up something, go on a plane, have a carry on, but have enough room to store your clothes. It's really not made to go out to the fair to to walking around with your friends in the city, but I use it anyway. And I may do, and it, now no complaints really. But I wanted to find something more that wasn't tactical, that was more definitely civilian, and that fit great, and that would serve its purpose. Thus, North Face came about. I discovered the Chimera 24, Chimera 24, excuse me, and I got it. And here it is. Now they make an 18. I recommend the 24, like I got here. It looks big on camera, maybe not, but to me, no, this ain't big. This ain't big at all, but this is just right for me. It's epic, it's just right for me. So this is the Chimera 24 by the North Face. It has a 70D nylon, and it has this new flash dry um, uh, design where it'll dry f fast, like flash, like Barry Allen, uh, that kind of fast. So it's supposed to dry really fast. We could find out later when we put it through this paces. Um, it has this new dyno cinch system, which is patent pending, and you can see right here, it's designed to cinch it um, where you can fix it either the right or the left. It does it so it gets it together at the same time. It works in sync with one another. Not the boy band, but in sync with one another. So it's really great. Now, I'm going to jump into this real quick. Uh, I'm trying to make the video as short as possible. The shoulder. Now, there's material here, it's a lot more beefier than in the front. In the front, it goes down kind of thin, but up here, it's beefy, padded, and it has like a ridge, a ridge system here that kind of hugs onto your, what are these, the traps right here. It feels really good on your traps, and then it rests down on your clavicle. It's really nice. Um, yeah, this thing's light. Like I said, this thing's only about an ounce. And you could throw it off a building and it'll just feather down to the ground. The North Face, what can I say? They make good packs. What what sparked my eye was this reverse uh, kangaroo pouch, so to speak, for you our marsupial levers out there. You have a reverse uh, kangaroo pouch that you can stick things in. I like that because even though it has water bottle pockets right here, and you can stick your water bottle pockets here, and you're fine. You can fit like a 24 ounce Nalgene bottle. You'd be good to go. Maybe squeezing a little bit uh, bigger, um, like a 30 ounce or whatever, whatever they make. But yeah, 24 ounce to be no problem. But I like this reverse kangaroo pouch. The reason why is you can just stick a jacket in here, kind of like the North Face uh, Borealis or Jester, where they have the shot cord zipping through the back. This acts as the same in the same vein, but it's a thin material all one like a clothy thin material which is very breathable so you can stick a wet pair of trucks in here or if your jacket got wet you can still stick it in there let it hang out and it'll dry that's what i like about it i want to recommend this book uh this backpack for like uh, your school because let me tell you why on this pocket right here it's really small it doesn't go down deep at all um this way but it kind of goes down where you could fit like maybe a, another water bottle here about that's about it or, you know, small trinkets, maybe car keys, things of that nature. On this side, though, it's pretty big. And it goes deep. And you can see that you can feel the padding back here. And it goes deep. So if you're wearing it, and if you want to, you know, pull it this way, open it up, you know, you can conceal too if you want. But it's really nice to uh, just grab it and grab your things out on your right side because most people are right-handed. You know, it goes in here and you can grab it. It's really good to go. The back padding is marvelous, simply marvelous. It has like a ridgy material here, um, which is like very chiropractic on your back. 
Um, and as you you carry a heavier load, it kind of will rub against your back and like a mild massage to your back. You know, that might get you going in the morning. I don't know. Uh, let's see here. Oh, check this out. It has in the in the the, the straps. You can put things in like batteries, chapstick. I don't know if you could fit a Leatherman in here, but it has these little elastic pockets that are the same material as the water po water bottle pockets. Like I said, a flashlight, anything small you could fit in there, your car keys. Um, it has, let me put it on. One thing I like about the Dino Cinch system, patent pending, is that it's very, um, it makes your posture, makes you want to stand up straight. This is definitely going to, if you have like scoliosis or anything, get this pack, it'll make you want to stand up straight. And that's really nice, man. So you have the um, sternum strap right here. Pop it on right here. Boom. There you go. Stand up straight. Let me go around. It's a really nice pack. Then, of course, it does have a hip belt, but it's, it's just merely to hold things together if you're running. Most likely, if you're using this to go to the fair or something, you're not going to need that hip belt, but it works. You know, hip strap. It's not hip belt. It's hip strap. But, yeah, this is great right here. And it, it, these uh, uh, sternal strap goes up and down, so you can have a lower, higher, whatever floats your boat. But, yeah, it's a really nice pack. I really think it's made really well. That 70D nylon is um, very lightweight. Like I said, it's, uh, it's about an ounce. Um, it has a place to clip your keys. It has a wonderful hydration uh pocket as well in the very very back so you can stick a hydration bladder has a place to clip it right here comes out comes in works really well or you can stick you know a jacket in here or whatever if you if you're just using this like i said to go to the fair disneyland wherever you want to go to you can stick things in here i think it's great it's uh, easy grab it and go you know leave it in your car it doesn't take a lot of space i mean what can i say the north face uh chimera 24 it's a great pack even the handle it's very thin but it's perfect for this pack I mean it's just a reg regular stitched in small handle you're not going to carry a lot of weight in this anyway but yeah it does a job it keeps it keeps the vein the aesthetic of just uh, simple sleek and dynamic now with that dyno cinch system patent pending what's great about it is it keeps it level you know the right and the left you can adjust them and it keeps it level so again it's a great grab and go bag have fun with the family with the kids with the fellas with the ladies um the fair you know small hike on the trails yeah the north face don't play around they're working on different designs and this design is really nice so again i'm second exodus i'm glad to see y'all i'm back skills first gear second and as always I just want to say, y'all have a good time out there. Hey, skills first, gear second, I'm out.